Turkish defense contractor Baker has posted a new photo from its facility that appears to show a new version of Bayraktar TB2 medium altitude long endurance unmanned combat aerial vehicle. The image, released at Baker's official Twitter account, showing an advanced version of combat drone with a satellite link system for remote control. According to local sources, the new version of the combat drone with satellite communication capabilities called the Bayraktar TB2S for satellite or TB3. It is expected that the new Bayraktar TB2S will be remotely controlled via the satellite link by pilots on the ground, which significantly increases the range of the drone compared to using a radio channel. Turkish military expert Dogan said about the test images, if I'm not mistaken, the other engine is the Pratt & Whitney PT-6 turboprop engine. This engine is also used in Herkes. It may be considered as an alternative to Akin Tiha. I think there are different alternatives. Said. Baker defense technical manager Selsyuk Bayraktar shared a section of the test of the engine produced locally by Ten his post on his Twitter account and gave the good news of Bayraktar TB3 UAV. Selsyuk Bayraktar stated in his post that the domestic engine, PD-170 or its derivative estimated to be, has been tested and this engine will be integrated into the Agency Teruzi unmanned aerial vehicle and Bayraktar TB3. Selsyuk Bayraktar engine the aircraft engine with the highest performance values by far in this class in the world. Launched as Selsyuk Bayraktar stated that the test, whose images were shared, was carried out a month ago, the engine tested was not a prototype and a mass production engine. There is no official statement yet regarding the design details and payloads of TB3, whose name is only mentioned. However, the estimates are that there will be a male, medium altitude, long stay in air, class UAV between Bayraktar TB2 and Akinsey.